Hi, I'm Ravi. I'm an MD PhD candidate at WashU. I'm going to show you how Mindset uses the continuous heart rate monitors you may already own to help you stress less so you can be more. I want you to meet Tyler. Tyler spent 13 months in Iraq in the US Army Infantry. He survived multiple IED blasts, and when he got back to the States, he endured a divorce as well as a prescription painkiller addiction. His current mission is finishing school. But when he gets to class, he often has an overwhelming thought. I can't do it. This is too much for me to handle. Moments after he has this thought, Mindset detects a change in his physiology and notifies him. In his phone, he sees his heart is activating, tap to improve your mindset. When he does, the first thing Mindset does is ask him how he feels. This allows Tyler to become a witness to his emotion rather than a product of it. After he enters in how he feels, Mindset suggests a set of clinical exercises that have been curated by clinicians. This time, Tyler chooses a controlled breathing exercise. This exercise allows Tyler to slow down his racing mind by focusing on his breath. After a few minutes, Tyler gets a reward. It tells him he reduced his heart rate by 59 beats per minute and reduced his stress levels by 20%. This means that Tyler just went from a stressed out state to taking command of his own physiology. And you can see that on the heart rate trace right there. So let me show you what's happening in Tyler's brain. When Tyler gets a stressor, an ancient part of his brain called the amygdala gets activated. This sets off a fight or flight response. Mindset detects the change in physiology that accompanies this activation and intervenes with the helpful exercise. This helps Tyler do what we call a cognitive override, getting him back to his best self. So Tyler's stressor is school, but Kim is a mother of two with a busy job. She knows how much her emotional regulation matters to the well-being of her family. Ben is a software developer at a startup. Like many of us, he knows what a wild emotional roller coaster being a part of a startup can be. Ben and Kim are part of the two and three of millennials and Gen Xers who look for stress reduction mechanisms, while Tyler's part of the one in five with anxiety, most of whom never seek professional help. For all of them, we've just launched Mindset. You can get it now in the Google Play Store, and you can join our iOS beta. And if you sign up as a part of launch, we'll give you one month free if you buy a wearable off our website, we'll give you an additional six months free. And you can go to our web portal where you get advanced analytics, like bioanalytics, as well as which locations give you the most stress. And more insights are coming soon. So Tyler sent us a message about what he thought of Mindset. So I asked him to read it for us so I could share him with you. So here's Tyler. When teaching my soldiers marksmanship, I would always tell them, slow is smooth and smooth is fast. I believe mindset works the same way. It starts slow, and before you know it, you retrain your brain. I still have a ways to go, but my life is exponentially better now using mindset. Thank you. We're mindset. Stress less. Be more. All right. For four minutes on the clock for Q&A. Who's got a question? Anyway, so you look super calm. That was great. What is your actual pulse right now? I'm just curious. <laughs> It's actually 142, <laughs> but I was uh, recording some meditations behind, and I, ha I was going to send you an email of that, that afterwards, so you'll see it. You pull it off. <laughs> um, I, I just have one quick question. So I happen to worry about everything. Like, I hear a small noise. I want to, like, crawl under the desk, I'm afraid. Um, for, for me, if, I, if my phone then notifies me and says, like, you're freaking out, calm down. For some, I have this bad, like, cyclical thinking where I, now I get even more worked up and more, more nervous. Have you seen people in those situations? How do you ha handle them? So in the people that we've tested this with, when they get a notification, they're happy that they have a tool set right there that can help them with it. And, you know, a lot of people have suggested that more notifications would make you stressed. But the latest clinical evidence shows that you want to identify your emotion multiple times a day. And once you can measure something, then you can manage it. Right. So it's not just you're freaking out and now I'm getting more nervous. It's you're a little bit more worried and here are very clear steps to calming down. Exactly. Right.
does this work go in younger people as well, children who may have trouble managing their own emotional states? So we are working with an adolescent and childhood psychiatrist. Uh, we haven't focused on that yet, but we think it could apply there as well. Have you looked at predicting when stress will occur uh, versus reacting to it? So for your, the example there, the gentleman would be stressed every time he went to class. So instead of waiting for him to get in class and his heart rate to go up, you predict from his schedule, okay, let me calm you down before you walk in. That's exactly what's coming. We have GPS, motion, as well as heart rate. So we're looking at predictive analytics in the next version. Got it. So I, I think this is super cool and very helpful for people. But my question is, how does this become a big business? So I'm going to leave that with my CEO. She's the expert on this question. Well, we're really keep talking. To bring this to as many people as possible. The place where we're starting is all of you. I know that there may be a couple stress founders in this room, um, and I think there's a large demographic of people who are seeking stress reduction methods. And so to reach them, we have therapists who are very interested in getting this out to their population and some content strategies that we're rolling out. In the long term, we've been working on some pilots with organizations that are feeling deep pain points in retention of employees as well as pharmaceuticals. Spend. Uh, how much is it going to cost for me each month to be calm? <laughs> for you or with Stress the me out. The oh, that's a big one. <laughs> Just ten dollars a month. That's it. Ten dollars a month. All right. Let's hear it from Mindset. Well done. <laughs> <laughs>